Hi friends, welcome back. This is Rashikar. Uh, today in this pre in this video, we are going to learn about design of DFA. In previous classes, we have designed uh, DFAs for six languages. Uh, if at all you are watching this video first, just go to it and come back. Okay. <coughs> Second, in this video we are going to design DFA for the language of length constraint. Okay, language L1 is like length of the string equal to 1 to length of the string equal to 2. Okay. Similarly, L3, and we can extend it to any level, any level. And I have to, uh, I also give the formula to the competitive exams. Uh, if at all you got this kind of question, and how how they will frame the question, I'll tell you. Okay, just follow. Okay, if at all you are preparing for certain net also, these classes may help. Okay. Okay. How will you design DFA? In previous class only, I have told that if at all you are going to design a DFA, you have to construct the language. Yeah, what is construction of language? To you have to derive all the strings which are there in the language. Okay, our language will be will be belong to the A plus B whole star. Okay, okay. Then length of the string equal to one. Length of the string equal to one. Nante. Uh, which kind of strings that may occur in this language okay epsilon uh, does epsilon occur no because length of the epsilon is zero so the string length may be a a is the string which is having length one or b okay it is these are not symbols i am saying that strings of length one strings of length one okay does a a comes no the length will become two so it won't come Okay, length of string equal to 1, length of string equal to 2, and length of string equal to 3. Okay, first we will construct and then we will extend. Okay, whenever I am starting to design a DFA, I will start with the initial state. You all know you have to start with the initial state. Okay, I have to accept either, either A or See, if at all I want to accept, I have to go to the final state on seeing A. You know, okay, A and features number, I have to go to final state, I am going there. Okay, that means A is accepting. If at all you want to accept B also, same, see, uh, I, I either A or B, on B also, I am going to the final state. See, by seeing this doesn't, I mean, some people may confuse. Okay, it is equal to, it is equal to this thing. A, B. It is equal to this. Don't confuse. See, uh, you can uh, uh, draw either ways, but it is sim simpler, right? If at all you are seeing A or B, you are going to the final state. Okay, you are going to the final state. That's fine. On A, you are having transition. On B, you are having transition. That's fine with the Q1. But at final state, you are not telling where to go on after. If at all you get length two. For that you have to reject. For rejection, you have to get them into trap. trap If at all the length is greater than one, I'll let them into trap. See? If at all length one it will accept. If at all length one it accepts. If it is more than length one, it will go into trap, it never come back and it remains in the non uh, non final state and it is the rejection. Okay, fine. If it is length 2, similarly length 2 is the LNT strings, what kind of strings that may occur, A, 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 B, B, A, B, B. Okay, it is the finite language, uh, you will be having finite number of strings. Similarly, you will be having same kind of strings. See, on A or B, if it is length 1, so under the notification, is length 0, length 1, length 2 that means you are going to length 2 a a a b b a b b and in the look just the length 2 you have to you are accepting okay for rejection see you have for, by the definition of the dfa well, acceptance 
DFA acceptance command when the term if at all you if at all DFA is accepting a language that means it has to accept all the strings that are there in the language and it have to reject all the other strings which are the, not there in the language okay for the rejection sake if at all it can length to two can tell and take away both we let them into trap very simple okay చూడండి ఇది సేమ్ సిమిలర్ గా ఉన్నాయి కాకపోతే లెంత్ ఇక్కడ లెంత్ వన్ లెంత్ టూ లెంత్ వన్ వస్తే వన్ దగ్గర యాక్సెప్ట్ చేస్తున్నాను తర్వాత అన్ని ట్రాప్ లోకి వస్తున్నాను లెంత్ టూ త్రీ ఫోర్ అన్ని ఇక్కడ ఇక్కడ తిరుగుతూ ఉంటాయి త్రీ ఫోర్ ఫైవ్ ఇక్కడ తిరుగుతూ ఉంటాయి ఓకే సిమిలర్లీ యూ కెన్ డ్రా ఫర్ ది లెంత్ లెంత్ త్రీ ఇట్ ఈస్ వెరీ సింపుల్ లెట్ టేక్ ఎ పెన్ అండ్ సీట్ టేక్ ఎ పెన్ అండ్ పేపర్ అండ్ డ్రా ఇట్ యూ కెన్ డ్రా ఇట్ ఓకే నౌ now see uh, i'll analyze it see if at all if at all you got the question in a competitive exam like this uh, what is the minimum number of states required for a dfa which accepts all the strings of length 1 one in apudu emna any strings vache mudu okay length 2 in apudu any strings vache nalugu length 3 in apudu any strings vastai okay i'll analysis and tell you see లెంత్ దీన్ని వన్ ప్లస్ టూ అని రాసుకోవచ్చా దీన్ని వన్ ప్లస్ టూ ప్లస్ టూ అని రాసుకోవచ్చా అదే త్రీ ఇది ఇన్పుట్ లెంత్ ఇన్పుట్ లెంత్ అదే త్రీ అనుకోండి త్రీ ప్లస్ టూ ఓకే ఎన్ అయితే ఎన్ అయితే ఎన్ ప్లస్ టూ ఇఫ్ అట్ ఆల్ యూ గాట్ ద క్వశ్చన్ లైక్ దిస్ ఇఫ్ అట్ ఆల్ ద లెంత్ ఆఫ్ ది స్ట్రింగ్ ఈజ్ వాట్ ఈస్ ద మినిమమ్ నెంబర్ ఆఫ్ స్టేట్స్ దట్ ఆర్ దేర్ ఇన్ ద డిఎఫ్ఏ విచ్ ఈస్ యాక్సెప్టింగ్ ద లాంగ్వేజ్ of length of all the length of the strings are equal to n okay if it is 100 and ichadu question lo ilaga isthadu question lo length of the string is 100 dfa lo any states untai 100 plus 2 102 1000 is the 1000 plus 2 1002 okay similarly okay this kind of questions may occur okay thanks for watching do share and like uh, share it to your friends or follow it you, if you follow it you will get a clarity and you can be able to solve all the questions which are competitive on the regular exams also uh, this kind of questions may occur in certain net and gate and degree lectures also there that uh, these kind of questions may help you okay please follow do subscribe or click on bell button thanks for watching